was the moment history was made this afternoon on Starbase after the Starship landed in the Indian Ocean for their sixth test launch. A huge deal. History definitely being made. Made Our CBS4 anchor Derek Garcia was able to catch all the action from Isla Blanca Park. Definitely a different atmosphere now, Derek. It's a little dark out there, but what can you tell us? Yes, Sydney. while people earlier today were watching science fiction become science fact, now there are people out here watching Mother Nature as the sun sets. Now, SpaceX is calling this a successful launch because of multiple reasons. One of them, for example, is because of that successful splashdown over in the Indian Ocean. And the other was because of the orbit relaunch that they were able to have. Now, the splashdown happened uh, in the Gulf of Mexico. The catch was called off just four minutes into the test flight for unspecified reasons, and the booster hit the water just three minutes later. Now, SpaceX hasn't specified just exactly what went wrong, but for so many people that were out here, it's not about what they got wrong. It's about what SpaceX is doing right. Many feel that they are watching America win the new age space race with Elon Musk and now President-elect Donald Trump at the controls quite literally. I spoke with an astronomer who came all the way from Poland who had to be here to witness the future and history all happen at the same time. It's hard to uh, call it race when there is only one, one, one guy in, in this race because he's far away b behind everyone else. So SpaceX doing something uh, extraordinary. Now, this sixth launch is very much the same as the fifth launch because of the flight path flight path and the objective of trying to get the booster caught back over here with those chopsticks uh, that are over there on Starbase. Now that part did not happen for, for so many of the people that were out here today. It's not so much about again what they got wrong, it's about what they got right. And while this is the sixth test, they were already looking forward for the seventh, the eighth, the ninth and the tenth because they believe that America is winning this space race because of just how far behind so many other mega powers around the world are following SpaceX's footsteps. Live outside of Isa Blanca Park, I'm Derek Garcia.